Thanks for messing around in Vampire Survivors Beswick 364. We're continuing to be beating every stage with every character in Ode to Castlevania with Familiar Familiar. New character gets more projectiles every 20 levels. Max plus 3, 1,320 gold. That's not a good sign. That's not a good sign at all. First, oh, hey. Oh, you can choose multiple familiars. Neat. Oh, that'll be fun for later. But we'll start with regular familiar right now, because I had no idea this is what it happened to be. Let's take that portrait and ruin some Castlevania. Well, I already know what evolves it. And I don't want to go full spellbook build again. This doesn't help. I mean, this heals. I should have chosen this in advance. That doesn't help anything. That doesn't help. It actually helps this weapon. Well, actually, no. The cross blast thing. Let's let's go boo from the start then. Maybe it'll increase the size of the heal field too. Well, that'll compensate. It's not like she takes extreme damage. Maybe I should have gone still behind her. Lord brothers. Uh, why aren't you firing out, Sword Brothers? I really thought they would fire out immediately. Sort of why I selected them. Why aren't you firing, Sword Brothers? Fire! Fire everything! My only chance. Central Custos is just good to have. Actually, give me a real weapon. Or the pastiche of a real weapon, anyway. Well, I'm gonna get Sparog next time. Get Power of Sire. Maybe try and get Power of Sire. Well, no, definitely get Power of Sire. I have Agony. That's her on the map. Starflail. Damage boost with recovery. Go, Sword Brothers, go! Just sort of get stuff randomly. A bit of a random setup. Alchemy Whip. It's been a while, Alchemy Whip. Let's whip some stuff out. Ba -boom. Sword Brothers is nice to have. Spellbinder. I don't know if the Refectio field actually lasts longer with stuff. And without Speculo, Refectio, uh, my damage is actually pretty low. I mean, it looks kind of bigger. It took me hard to tell these things. I'm gonna Spagony. Area Might, Speed, and Duration. Every good stat you want. Cosotas. Help uh, the Cosotas. Centralis. Catabrasis. Round. Level up. Where is this track from? It's pretty nutty. Refectio, Rebectio. And all the vampires have immune to health green on their thing. I need Pomerola. Da -da. Wings can be grabbed for Armadillo. I do get a health buff from it, too, don't I? Yeah. Okay, so much better off. Alright, Candle Labrador, Wings, Bronus Box. Let's make our area nice and big. Spinage, Spinage is good. Spinage is good. When are you ever going to turn down Spinach? Well, we need to evolve something critical, and it's your last passive slot. Blast them. Big and tall. I'm not even thinking about my other weapon setups, huh? Well, it'll just be with whatever's here. I want the Atlantean now. It's kind of annoying to have him show up. Everywhere. 
but eventually this will be strong enough to just survive with no trouble. Suppose I should have hit that on the way back. The choice then becomes, do I want to grab wings first and move faster? Sounds like a resounding yes. The sooner I can get the rest of the stuff, the better. That, that, quite the healing, huh? Alright, try and get Sanctuary somewhat quickly. Well, Clover is going to be slow. Yeah, this is where I want to go. Let's get more fairies. Oh, no, I, no, no, my weapon slots are filled out. Neat. No, the entrance is here. The entrance is here. Here. Here, an entrance there, an entrance everywhere, an entrance, entrance. I mean, there he was most people's first familiar, right? I know, sure, sure, it was mine. Well, that and Imp. Because Game Shark. Remember when Game Shark and Cheats existed in games? That feels like forever ago. Sword! Go, sword, go. Oh, it was her healing field. I was doing the one. Mine did more. Interesting. Oh, let's go grab some stuff. Here, mate. Oh, it's... It's not the circle that gets it, it's the big old cross thing that gets increased in size. Wow, I did not notice that whatsoever. 94 area without King Arbador is pretty nice. Wings. Rapidus Feo. Actually, no, I should've... I need to combine. Uh, well, no, that won't change my stuff, because I'm grabbing them off the map after. That won't change anything. The liner's better here. For what I'm needing. Alright, Fairy's looking like she might not have too much trouble. Ukabok. Well, Innocent Devil. It'd probably be the same thing. Get the rest of the... Familiar's out. Oh man, that means... Well, no, I didn't add party... Well, party horses is different. Also, I checked before I started this, and I don't can't see any difference between the Shinoa costumes. Like, there didn't seem to be any difference whatsoever. Wait, you just... No. No, you didn't drop an evolution chest. Why didn't you drop an evolution chest? That's bizarre. Oh, I will get Galmoth before air long. Clover's still only at two, though. Man, it took me forever to get Crown up. Innocent Devil's probably made the other half of the familiars. It's very as Maria's. Let's get a Sword Brothers out. Double Sword Brothering. Wait. What was that? Oh, that's a very s big slow. I mean, both of them firing out. You're basically stuck. Okay, I didn't realize that the that was not only the cross, but it was also this blue field too. That's helping keep things in safe. You only get healing on the direct little blue glyph. But everything else contributes to the damage. Hm. And with enough cooldown, enough duration, keep that going for quite a while. The whole screen will be blue. And then it sends the blast out when you get it for Specula with Gemini. Neat. And it does not want to give me the clover, huh? 
And remember, I need to grab everything down here for once. It means I actually have to run through the middle section, which I usually ignore. And I said it last time, but it's more clear here, but there's no CD up there on the loading screen. It's a VS for Vampire Survivors. Yay, Vampire Survivors. Alright, boss. Just in case I somehow get Clover leveled up. Ow. Ran into you for half a second and I'm toasted like that. Still, the damage is nice and consistent. So that helps. Alright, let's get Candelabra Dwarf first. It's a slightly bigger benefit. Do some damage. Get some speed. That is a fairy need boots. I also noticed a bunch of other characters like Karasu Man at flight. Like, what does that mean? Does that mean they just wall break all the time? I think Dina and Lino can do that. I'm not even sure about Lino. Not even sure about Lino. Oh man. It's, even I can sometimes tell how nasally my voice is. Oh, I was invincible for quite a while there. Oh, does Base Sonic Dash just do that too? You know, Chesto. Luto. Ventralisu. Fairies is quite small. Yeah, now that there's less visual clutter, I can actually see the difference between Refectio and the Fairy Refectio. Very familiar Refectio. Still nothing for the clover. Actually, I'm kind of incredible how bad that luck's been. Whop it. Whip it good. He whips pretty close. Getting it earlier does mean it gets start supercharging it faster. Yeah, I'll re-roll. It's not much I need otherwise. Over, alchemy whip. Hey. That's it for right now. We want an evolution. We'll go sanctuary. Which the actual sanctuary blast won't do much, but it'll still get me the refectio size increases. Alright, I got two things on the verge of evolving. I feel like I could have just grabbed the chest and moved on. Been smarter. There's a big level up. Now I'm rolling the dice. Really, really needed that up fast. Let's get some stuff out of the pool while we're here. Sonic Dash, Sonic Dash, Super Sonic Dash. What a great weapon. Is there a time when you don't want Sonic Dash? No. That means it's the best weapon in the game. Sanctuary where fears and lies melt away. Alright, there's one at a time we're going. But we'll be at two a timer. Who knows? Probably not. And all our door. I actually don't know my way through the ice cavern all that much. And go to the middle room. All too often. Well, I guess they're both the middle room. Well, this is the middle room. I don't go to the right side of the right or left side of the right room. Yes, that'll work. Increasing more size, increasing more. Even though I only have like one weapon that really gets the benefit of that. Oh right, I gotta go get head. Of dog. Dog head. Another big level up. Let's go. Yep, didn't mean to do that. Alright. Huge level up, in fact. Speed breaker. Means I have a fast track to get what I need here. 
Alright, let's target our Gale Moth so I can get that tier Jisu. Definitely Silver Ring over there. Oh, maybe I need to be Gale Moth with Dracula or Alucard to unlock him. Sonic Dash. Now we're repeat a Steel Wind. Do want to get rid of you ASAP. Just so I don't accidentally chest into the tier Jisoo or something. But no, I can repeat a Sphio. That's the whole point of everything. Alright, grab more dog head. The head of the dog. Dextro Custodis. I'm never going to remember the first one except for Centralis, because that's much easier to remember. Even then, I'm going to keep messing it up. Because my mind does not work. Oh, there are paintings here. Huh. Starflail. That can evolve with Pomola. You're cl Oh. I don't know if it needs to be maxed, but we'll do that. It does need to be maxed. For Moon Rotten. Oh, right. I have Vampire Killer, which means the bosses do not survive. Moon Crescent Rod. Bye bye, Darklin. Dominus Anger. Use the power of Sire and get real up in here. Alright, Toronis box. To add on some more power. Down a Sanger. Oh, both of you are down here. The Arcana chest. Arcana chest is coming up soon. Big level ups. Do you have extra growth? No, that's regular growth. Might even be below average growth. Well, leveling up at a pretty decent pace, all things considered. Warlocks, old rocks, warlocks, warlocks. Warlocks? The other count. Let's get Karoma's mana. Quite a low kill count right now. Quite a low kill count. Bosses go down quite quickly. So quickly that there's a chest up here somewhere. There we go. There's the union for Trinum Custodum. Yay, dog heads. Wow, this is far down. Okay, so it's Awkward. I don't think I was remotely this low. Double attacks will win the day. Oh, even all rocks went down quickly. That's what you expect from this. Mad cap power. Oh, we got sword brothers. Bravo, we are pinned here. Alrighty, I think I have things well in hand. Just grab that last armadillo and wreck some bosses with a familiar. I didn't even see the other weapons for the other ones, huh? Oh, well, just sort of grab whatever. Oh, you know, that's a big level up, yeah. Do I want to go skull or duplicator? Heads always wins. No. Heads get ahead. No, that's dumb. Heads, beds. Heads makes your enemies bed. Heads, heads, beds. Heads, 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 yeah. I don't think the 3K is in dream. Less than like a quarter off 
for a quarter away from you. Ah, uh, only 25. Where are you, though? I actually need to find a boss, because it's a lot. Uh, speed! Why do you have speed? You can't do anything with speed. Well, also, it doesn't matter, because we tag Leo. Where am I? Good grief, Atlantean. That was instant. That was insane. Something seems to be weird going on with the XP here. This is a bit too high, I think. A bit too high. The power of Cyrus here it tells you to be. What? Why did it just jerk me out like that? Alright, these are all good to pull of all. Just the armadillo, and grab the ring, and we'll be good. Run, run, run to that armadillo. We'll pick it up, let it low, an armadillo. Yeah, Skull and Maniacs can get the most kills here over Duplicator. I mean, I don't think Duplicator even affects Power Sire here. Now, was there a boss? Yeah, there is. Hi, boss. You're lasting way longer than you should. And yet, not long enough. Whip's quite huge, too. In fact, it's gotten so big, it's not even on Familiar's model anymore. Ah. Nice. Okay, let's go grab the gold ring. Probably would have been faster, you know, teleport. Teleports are there for. But I want to run through the walls. Maybe Wicked Season to end it out. I think it even bursted. I think it was getting Vampire Killer. Maybe I had boss tag to the Atlanteans? It's been a while, and I think there's been, like, some secret patches. Skull is worth more XP. Fire, fire, fire. Oh, it's so far ahead of her. 141. Yeah, get levels quick. Get more curse. Now I max out. Good grief, that was 50 levels. Or 40 levels. A lot of levels. We'll go with that. A lot of levels. A lot of levels. Well, taking the lead over to the 300k mark. What would I want for my chest? Another big full screen clear. Well, I could go fight the other Atlantean. Make sure the familiars are all golden egged. But I also kind of want to wait, just wait for Wicked Season. And then grab all these gems with that. On the other hand, I would increase my damage if I grabbed all these gems right now. But will the payoff be worth it? And if I increase my damage, that means there'll be more gems more gems faster. Will the payoff be worth it? Who knows? Definitely grab some gems when I go grab the Arcana chest anyway. Well, let's think about it while I go do something else. Map gif? Why would there be a map gif of this? What's the map gif of this?
Okay, whatever. Oh, there's so much to do, so much to see. And I can't even take the back streets anymore. They've all been taken over by roaming gangs of toughs. Okay, well, none of the power of this character is really from familiar herself. Themselves? Well, fairy. I guess that's why it's familiar, not fairy. It's because you get the other ones. That makes sense. That makes sense. Oh, I should check the picture. Okay, there's something weird when you take screenshots with three... Oh, not the 360. Wow, would this game not work on a 360? But on the Series X. It actually needs like a whole minute to process the photo correctly or something. Otherwise, like sometimes I've hit the take screenshot button on Fairy or Familiar, or, well, not Familiar, on other characters, then I would move to go take the screenshot for the next one. Then when I go look in my folder, I got two of the second character and none of the first character. Wow, that's exploded ahead. I think the character with everything would have less kills, or more kills, but hey, I guess not. Did she have... Heck, I didn't even think she ran with Polaro. She was Wicked Princess with a star, wasn't she? No, she did go Bolero. She had multiple arc extra arcana, you know, Maria Renard. We're a new character fairy today. Uh, so, thanks for messing around. I hope you have been having some fun on the Vampire Survivor's Beswick, as it were. I definitely have, even though times like this are a try and Really, in all the darkest days of all my life, the support people give me, whether just by a comment, a watch, a view, a like, it's been good to see. Even if it's just the one, or the two, or the three. Right, Arcana Chest should be coming up soon. So, if you'd like to show me some support more, i deeply appreciate it. When I live stream, I try to thank everyone individually. Maybe I occasionally miss someone, but... Hey, that's what it is. But occasionally it's just like that. Also, I'll actually have this one recorded more than two hours before it gets posted. Oh, my timing is going to be awful. Well, no, I'll... Whatever. Regardless of anything. Where are you, Arcana Chest? There you are. We roll for a wicked season. Let's go crazy here. That's quite a lot of levels. Hey, a chest. Candy box. Anything here that I really want? Um, or I guess roll bomb for some comedy. Roll bomb for some comedy works. I mean, it has, I think it gets the benefit of area two, right? That's why it's damage gets so extreme. In addition to just firing out, it reaches so far, so much farther than pentagram or a lot of other moves. Oh, that whip is so big, it's almost starting off screen. Nice. Troll bombing. Wait, I should've just gotten the chest. That would have given me all those levels on the troll bomb through that. It gave me a couple more limit break levels instead, oh well. I think I'm in terrain. It's hard to tell. I wonder if Power of Sire also lasts longer with more duration. 
doesn't seem to, it doesn't seem to make sense, but, you know, the ultimate power in the world is cooldown. 300k? Heck, if this keeps up, she might break 400k. You know that just a couple of... Part oh, I missed that growth season, whoops. I got distracted with nothing. As I do, as I do. Okay, good, I have an index. We ran out of disk drive space. I'm almost gonna have to start cleaning out the Bezwick videos for the old to Castlevania stuff. Gotta clear them off the old hard drive. 4K videos are so huge. Oh, absolutely insane. Oh yeah, level up. Now I laid everything with them troll bombs. I want the whip to be entirely off screen. Then we know we're cooking with area. What's it at anyway? 532. Pretty large, halfway to max. All them boosts I'm given. I have every boost, in fact. I have silvering, I have candle over I have Tornus Box, and I have Dominus Vagony. Let's boost it up some more. Another 20-ish levels added on to the size. 22, it seems. 22, 22, 22 levels to go. I wanna get your gems. I know like one line from every song ever. I can't give you anything in full. Uh, the whip's so bad, big now that you can actually visibly see its size increasing and decreasing. That's great. That's just great. Our oh, 4K is looking like the dream, but 500K is that within grasping. Da -da. I think we're over almost a 600 here, area size-wise. More than enough area to have compensated for the decreasing radius. I mean, by default, it effectively evens out, but the way the math works is that you need something like 100 levels to make sure that it's always beneficial compared to how it would be if you just didn't have Google. Ah, uh, 591. My dang, hits have been going down. Oh no. Oh no, fairy, oh no. I mean, Dominus Agony is so good, it's probably like the default in any build you want. And Centralist Custodus is also pretty nice. To have at any time. Yeah, I think the kills have slowed down too much. That can't be right. Well, that was odd. I guess I didn't get the red gem. Maybe they're dying so far off screen that they aren't dropping gems where they should. I'm gonna rush down. Grab that vacuum down there for the next growth season. I wanna hit my mark. Okay, yeah, 500k is way out of bounds unless I get, like, 50 levels from this vacuum down there. No vacuums up top either. There we go. Not bad, not bad. 628 area. The whole screen is my oyster. I mean, not even Dominus... Whatever... ...causes the issue. Actually, I have every weapon now, don't I? That means I don't need to include a thing about evolutions. 
this, they've all been seen by now. Yay. Yeah, I think Dominant Power of Sire was the last thing in the collection. The one after Clock Tower was just Specular Blobus, which I didn't realize at the time. I just got that off camera because, eh, Specular Blobus. Could have gone just a full Gemini build with other stuff. It's just all spellbooks, and I did enough spellboxing. Oh, I might do No Thoughts Head Empty, which is a Holo Cure achievement where you just grab the first thing. It's sort of just random. I'm not Brave Story Random. Well, no. I mean, I'm supposed to just get the Brave Story to save myself in time there. Oh. I do need to keep the... Oh, I'm over 40 characters in here, right? That means I'm over halfway through with Old Castlevania. Still so many more to go. Then so many more to go beyond that. See what these weapons look like when they're doing nothing but soloing. Some of them are going to be great. That's how I got Mace. Boy, is Mace scary. Hammer's even scarier. Some of them are going to be really bad. Oh god, blinding fire, or raging riot. Rock riot, raging fire. I keep thinking it's like blind fire or something weird. Some of them are gonna rate, some of them are gonna be awful. Oh god, full gore, oh god, full gore. That is just a nightmare and a half to come. Alright, but for the interquill, it's gonna be like. Okay, it's 85 base characters. That's 22 runs. I'm not doing that in one video. 11's too much, too. Eh, who's 5, 5, 2? Well, I'll figure it out on the way. Because I also have invincible characters to do the middling with. Oh, right, this is the trailer music, isn't it? Oh, death counts as a boss, as you'd expect. Wait, what was that? That was like a million damage. You killed death with this? Yeah, he's dead. Or, yeah, Power Sire just ate Red Death. I didn't get any eggs out of it. But yeah, he's totally not here on screen anymore. Okay. Let's just double check this to make sure. Oh, right, I forgot to move and get levels. That would have probably been helpful for reaching the 500k mark. Yeah, he just vaporized death instantly. Good god. Good god. So what? Sanctuary did it? Sanctuary is the one that did that damage? Good god, what? Well, I guess Sanctuary instantly beats Red Death? That seems odd. Oh wow, Vampire Killer actually outdid Power of Sire, holy crap. And everything else is sort of where it is. Sword Brothers... Well, everything was dying before Sword Brothers could accomplish anything. But, yeah, either... Sanctuary instantly kills Red Death or Power of Sire does. One of those just did an enormous amount of damage. Oh, no secret stunt here, but next up it's going to be an innocent devil. And the very big familiar has given us a very big victory. And actually surpassed Maria pretty not difficultly. That's 1,997 done, 127 characters. Next up it's going to be the innocent devil over there 
Yep. Honest and devil, clearly. Innocent. Devil. Devil. I'm just going to go with Deku. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. On the right is the start of the Bezook. On the left is the next or best video. And in the center is a subscription if you haven't already. Please do so. Thank you anyone who has supported me with a like, dislike, comment, or subscription. I hope everyone has a good day and you keep messing around in the Vampire Survivor's Beswick.